when I first meet a patient, it's essential to take a detailed history with particular reference to whether there were any problems with the actual initial healing phase or whether there was an infective complication. Then the next most important fact is the time between the injury and when I'm seeing the patient because in the early phase there's a lot of conservative management strategies to optimise the quality of the resultant scar. If over a year has elapsed then it depends on what components of the scar are of poor quality, whether the scar is red, raised, stretched or poorly orientated and the plan I would construct would be bespoke on the problems that presented themselves to me.